y'all this is Dina welcome to my channel I am back it is Saturday morning 7 30 in the morning and I am unboxing my Frank Garcia haul this morning y'all I was gonna do this last night but after I finished uh, loading the video for scrap diva designs my hubby came home and that was it <laughs> just spend time with my hubs but anyway, I thought I would get this all open this morning. I've only opened the top. And I see on the top here that they have added some Christmas paper. I didn't order Christmas paper. Um, not at all. Um, so I'm glad that um, they, they sent these to me. I could use them at a later time. They're very pretty and they would make great, great cards. Okay, I'm going to get everything out. And this is what it looks like. So, looks like it kind of got juggled up around and, and uh, shipping or whatever. Because normally this is all really nicely together and everything. So, but let me tell you about, let's just talk about, let's just talk right now about USPS, okay? Let me just tell you, so I was tracking this and it came from, I believe, California. And it made it to... Um, it made it to um, Dallas, and it made it to my local post office, and then go figure, instead of them having it out for delivery, they sent it back to Fort Worth, then it went to Dallas, and then made it back to my local post office, and finally got delivered to me. What's up with this? Are they not sorting them right? I don't know. If you're a mail carrier, let me know how this works. I know that I was tracking um, Scrap Diva Designs package because she always sends an email when she's sending something. And that one went from Georgia to Georgia to Georgia. And instead of coming like toward, you know, central USA where Texas is, it went all the way to New York before it got routed here. It went through so many different mail hubs. It's kind of crazy. I don't know. But I'm very grateful that this has made it. And I can't wait to take a look. Okay, so I stopped for a second. I took everything out of the box. And y'all, I ordered. Y'all, I broke down and ordered Maggie Holmes Paracel. And I also ordered um, Gingham Gardens. And this is by Cray Paper. I just thought it was just beautiful, so springish. I wasn't going to order Paracel, but the more I looked at it, um, the more I started liking the print. So whenever I opened the box, this is what came in it. And it's telling me that if you order over $75, use code free ship to get free shipping. So anyway, I sure would love to go to this store. It would just be amazing to go to the store. But I live in Texas, so let's just get going here. So I'm going to kind of separate these out. Let's start by going through all the papers. So I, I have um, two of the paper pads, and I ordered also extra papers like I normally do. Let's get you out here a little bit. Okay, excuse my mess around me. I was working last night on the embellishment box. Look at all the purples. This one's kind of a fuchsia, but still in a nice, uh, let me open this. And I'll show you how I'm going to decorate this soon. But all that purple goodness right there for my swap partner. Okay, so this pair, this one is Paracel. And this is Maggie Holmes, one of her new ones. I think she's got one called Woodlands coming out. But um, we'll see if I, if I like it, if I like the colors. But I started looking at this originally. I said, I'm not going to get Paracel. It wasn't my favorite thing and all that. But the more I started looking at the prints, I really did like it. I love the florals and I loved like the lemons. She, of course, always has a little house in her designs and always has swans and stuff. So things that she always has um, is always in like pretty much most of her collections okay so i ordered two of these um tags and just cut apart section i don't really love this back i'm not crazy on that because i'm not really a huge green person but you know that's okay and this one is paracel this one is really cute look at that it has see it has scissors it has uh yarn 
Yeah. Oh, it's just so crafty. And it's like got sweaters. It's like knitting and oh, it's pretty cute. I like it. So I ordered one, two, three of these extra. Love the back. The blue is simply gorgeous. Okay. And then this one, love this one. And I ordered three of these extra because I did order a paper pad too. This is the back. It looks like a, like a ledger. And then this one, I really like the lemons. So I ordered, I ordered actually three of these as well. And this is the back. The back's not bad to me. I like that. And then I like the stripes, but y'all look on the back. Oh, I love that. And this is super cute. The little animals so I ordered. I usually order like two or three of each one extra if I want to keep them in my stash. Because you know, if you only order one, you're going to wish you had another one and you don't want to cut the one. That's what it comes down to. Now this one is simply just gorgeous. I ordered three of these extra. Oh, I actually ordered four. And there's the back. That's gorgeous. I love this. Love the blues. And this right here is so darling. Oh my goodness. I really do like this. You'd have to figure out how you can utilize this page unless you're a scrapbook or something. Um, to make cards or whatever you want to use it for. But look at the precious church over here. That is just simply so cute. And I got three of those and it's yellow or kind of a gold on the back. And this one I super love. I love this. I love the designs. It's just gorgeous. Okay, I'm glad I ordered it. And look at this. Got some clouds. That is so pretty. Let me see what the name of this paper is. Uh, Florasian. It says Blooming Florasian. So pretty. I do like this. Okay, now I love, love, love the bows. I ordered four extra of this one. This one is called Precious. That's what it's called. So pretty. And there's the back. I wish they would have put like a pink on the back instead of putting this green, but that's okay. Um, I ordered an extra three of these, and I think I ordered it for this piece because I don't really care for the other side. I'll use it, but beautiful. And then this one, I have two of this one, and this is the back. I really love the back. It's gorgeous. And then this one is, this one's beautiful. And I can't believe I ordered three of one that wasn't the most beautiful. And I didn't order but two of this one. There's the back. But the butterflies are so pretty. So pretty. And then this one, it's called King Heart. The name of the paper, but y'all, look, I love it. It's my favorite. I only ordered two. Oh my goodness. So pretty. So pretty. Okay. And this one looks like I ordered three, but look at this. Isn't this so pretty? Love this. And this is gorgeous. So pretty. So, so, so pretty. And I ordered two extra of this pink one. It's called Discover. That's really cool. Really, really pretty. Love this one right here. You see that? So pretty. And then got two extra of this one. This is really neat. It's got different kinds of cameras. That is a really neat design that she did on this. And this one is called Bonjour. Hola. And that is probably why I got it from that pink side. And then the black and white flowers, gorgeous. Okay, let me see, I got three of these. Let me see the back, and y'all look at it. it, looks like a city map. 
Let me see if, what it's called. It's just called Beautiful Day. That's interesting. Okay, and then this one is Oh La La. And that's really, really, really pretty. My Forever. And we got two of these. This is the back. That's really, really pretty. I don't think anything is going to take the place of of some of her other collections. Um, I think that All Heart, I would love to get my hands on All Heart. And some of those other ones, you know, the, the other ones with really bright, vibrant, just soft in a way, pictures, is that's really what I wished for. Now, this is really, really pretty. Looks like I only ordered one extra of this one. When I get throw things in my cart, sometimes I kind of forget how many. Now, I ordered like five of these because this one I think is simply beautiful. And I love the back. This right here and the heart one, gorgeous. So pretty. And then this one, I ordered three. And it's kind of hard to tell what they really look like um, on a picture. You know what I mean? Now, this one is called Regards. Okay. And then this one is Meadowlark. And if you're wondering what I call them, the name if you're new to this, the names are at the top. This one's really pretty. Love it. And here's the back. So that one I love, love, love. Okay. Then I ordered, this is a piece. Um, this is, says Foil on Perforated Cardstock. How pretty is that? Looks like I only ordered one of these, and I don't know if maybe I didn't know if I was gonna like it, but look at that. So pretty, that's beautiful. Okay, so let me go, I'm gonna finish up doing carousel. And so I did also order the 12 by 12. So I do have some extras. I won't kind of thumb through since I just showed you all of them. But these are single-sided when you order like this. And I also did order the 6x8. I'm kind of into ordering both of them. Just because it's a little bit smaller scale. And you can, like if you wanted maybe a card or something like that. You've got the smaller scale as well. So that is Paracel. Let me see if I ordered any extra. I ordered... The puffy stickers from this collection and I just want to make sure if I've ordered and I looks like I ordered the ephemera pack of these so there and you can see on the back here what comes in it I like these so pretty so 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 pretty and let me see, I think everything else I have over here goes to the gingham, okay? So let me move Paracel over. And I want to see if gingham beats Paracel. So I ordered, and let me see, did I order any chipboard pieces? Oh, yes, I did. I ordered the Paracel um, chipboard piece as well. Okay, so that was Paracel. And now this one is gingham and this one is let's open let's pull this one up this is gingham garden and it's by cray paper okay so let's go through the extra papers and i think i already love this one the most though okay so this one is called love this look at that isn't that beautiful y'all i think this one is better than parasol already I got that love 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 this is going to be great when I'm using scrap deeper designs dies very springish and very beautiful there's the back and then I got two two of these it's timeless look at this like the little design looks like it's etched in the wood there's the back and this is gorgeous Oh my goodness. Ah. Now this one is gorgeous. I ordered one, two, three. Looks like I ordered four extra of the butterfly page. It's called All Right. 
That's what it's called. And there is the back. Beautiful. I like this collection. It's more, more softer looking, if that makes sense. And then this one is Fresh Air, and this is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. And then, oh my goodness, I love this. Y'all know I love rainbows. So pretty. And this one is in the shade. And there's the back. This is a gorgeous collection. Gorgeous. And then this one is called Blooms. Got two extra of these. And then this is Sylvaneer Memory. This is really pretty. I've already got some more stuff in my scrapbook.com haul. Uh, um, cart because there's a couple of new papers that I saw that come out that I need in my life. So hopefully I'll order it soon. This is beautiful too. Love that. And then this is so beautiful. This one is called Nostalgia. It's gorgeous. And a lovely one. I love the Paisley print. And it's got like a graph or a ledger paper on there too. Isn't that funny how those are kind of similar and they're not even the same designer. And I absolutely love this one. I've got four pages of this one. But this is so stinking cute. I love that. And look at the back. This is so much fun. I love that so much. I'm glad I ordered that. And then this one is called Be Kind. I ordered two of these. So pretty. I think collections these days are getting better and better and better. And I ordered two of these vellum pieces. So pretty. And then I ordered the chipboard sheet. The chipboard stickers and this is really beautiful i love i love that right there so pretty and i love it's just soft very pretty sometimes i like vibrant sometimes i like soft and all that so then of course i ordered the 12 by 12 of this one too so let me see if i can flip through it's just what you just saw so i'll just do a quick flip and these of course are single-sided love this one that's beautiful okay so what i maybe i missed it my favorite one there it is <laughs> there it is right there so it looks like this one is 48 pages and uh, maybe there's more there's two of each let me see if i see another one of the beautiful one I'm thinking there is two of each. So anyway, that is that. I also did, of course, order the six by eight. Just a smaller scale, of course. Love this. Look, I didn't see this. I saw one, look at this. Oh, it's really pretty. And see, it's, it, it's foiled on here. It's not foiled on the other papers. Let me see if I can open this. My scissors. Y'all, I have a purple mess over here because I'm working on my swap. Today, I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna work on my swap, see if I can work on some, some design team. When I get, last month when I got my design team package from Scrap Diva Designs, I tried to just include what she sent me and what I could send to my partner. So it was kind of a win-win. I worked on my swap at the same time as working on projects with my, my design team package. Okay, so let's find that one. This is gorgeous too. I really am glad I got this one. See, that's gorgeous. Look how it's foiled. Let's see if we can go a little bit closer there. So you can see this one a little bit better. 
See? On the original one, it's not foiled, but here, it is foiled. So it's worth it to get the 6x8 if you want the foiled paper. And this one, on this one on here is in the, is like etched with the white, and it's not foiled, see? And on the 6x8, it is foiled. Interesting. So beautiful. I love it. I love it. I'm so glad I ordered it. Y'all, there's always more and more beautiful collections coming out. Okay, let me show you the extras that I also picked up for this. For the Gingham Bar Garden, I also picked up the puffy stickers. And I just picked up one of the of these thickers. I think that this one goes for the Maggie Homes. And then this one is for Gingham Gardens. It's called Happy Life. So pretty. Look, got some rainbows. This one's really, really pretty. And then I did pick up the ephemera pack, and this is what's in there. And I also picked up this one. It's like a stationary pack. I thought it would be nice for when you're... Oh, and look, it comes with a little bag. Let's open this one. So this one is 20 pieces. Okay, so much tape. I'm sure that's what my kids think when they open a Christmas present from me. Because I'm a taper. Oh, I could have opened it from the bottom. Duh, Dina, duh. Okay, so we got to see this, y'all. We got to see this. Okay, so it looks like, like a little envelope. And you've got some, like, scallop circle. Two plus two. See that? And this is a vellum piece, and this is a little envelope. Look. And scrapbooks. Look, you got a little... This is so cute, looking at a little photo in there. So pretty, and look. I like this, this is so cute. Okay, let me try not to lose everything. I can put those back in there. And let's see, I think I can pull it out from behind, or the bottom this time. that over so we've got some little pieces got some little perforated holes in there oh I like this one it says happy day got some little tickets and these have little tabs on the top look a little bag oh this is cool and this looks like a little thing to put a gift card in so cute and then look we've got this is an envelope. Let's see how it how it is when we open it. When you open, look at that. You can make a beautiful card out of that. And let me put this back so I don't lose anything. Because I will. Okay, and then we got this tabs. And then this is a little frame. That's a little file folder. And look, a little, a little bag. How cute is this? This is cute. Now, if I go and if I, I, if I, if I look at this and do I think this is the cutest two collections I've ever seen? No, it's not, not to me. But there are some beautiful papers in here that I, I um, have never seen, of course. And and you never know, you might need some of these, like in your crafting. And this one, this Gingham Garden, is really, really beautiful for, you know, for spring crafting. Anytime crafting, but spring to me. And so, let's see if I could put this back. But yeah, that is what I picked up. I really do like the 6 by 8s I'm really liking this. I think I might, going forward, always try to get the 6 by 8s 
You know, again, it's a smaller scale. Very pretty. They're very pretty. Okay, I'm trying to move this stuff back over here and it's following for me. Okay, so both of the collections are gorgeous. Both of them are a must-have in my book, but there are a lot more beautiful ones out there too. So I'm excited to be able to work with these, have them in my stash for when I want to work with them, and I'm loving it. I'm loving it so much. Well, I hope that you guys are, I hope you guys enjoyed this um, quick haul. Love this. This is so pretty. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. And I hope that, um, yeah, if you're in the need for any of these collections, hope maybe it will inspire you on which papers you want to get and which ones not to get and so forth. So yeah, that's it. I hope you have a great day and um, or Saturday or whatever day it is you're watching this. You know, I hope that you're having a great day day and doing something that you love so anyway i will probably be back later with my next um video for maybe for design team and also maybe for my swap so anyway i hope you guys um just have a great day love you guys bye